Welcome back. Now, whenever we are updating a movie, it's better to move to to pass the movie ID with the with the dictionary that you already that we already have. Instead of passing two different type of data, we can pass the ID with the dictionary, and it's actually a better practice. So this way, this is not wrong, but it's better to say here. It's better to say movie dictionary, and then get the ID from the dictionary. So here, we need to say movie and then ID. Because now we are dealing with a dictionary and we can use that dictionary to pass, to insert the ID in the dictionary, and then we can fetch that ID from the dictionary. So there is no need to pass two different parameters. So the user now would have to pass title, year, storyline, and ID, exactly as if the user is, uh, if the user uh, was uh, creating a movie but all the only difference is that in the in creating a movie we don't pass an ID we pass the title the we we, we supply the title the user supplies the title the, the title the year and the, the storyline uh, however in updating a movie we supply the the endpoint with title with the year and storyline and the ID as well so let's now test let me save and test now let me here refresh now instead of passing let me show you this now instead of passing here this update movie if you click on try it out you will not have two different uh, types of data instead you will have only one uh, type which is the dictionary now in the dictionary we need to supply the dictionary with four parameters we need the ID the title the year and the storyline so let's edit, for example, the ice age here. I'm going to say ID. The ID is 990. Uh, and then, by the way, here I should say ID. And then title. So the title is going to be ice age. And then year. So I'm going to change the, I'm going to change the year. Again, I'm going to say uh, uh, 2025, and then finally we have the story line. I'm going to say new or updated movie, just for the sake of testing. Now let me click on execute, and if I click on execute, as you can see here, it's going to return the movie now. In the database, we should have the new, the updated data. Let me refresh. And as you can see, the movie has been updated. Now we have the Ice Age and the year is 2025. The storyline is uh, updated uh, movie. So this is how you can, instead of passing two different types of data, you can pass only one type, and then you can use that to update the uh, movie.